Hello and welcome back to Everything Gaming and today I'm going to show you guys a really really good method of making a lot of credits, a nice amount of XP, skill points and earn some very very cool cars in the process. Now this is very easy, it's not a glitch, basically the reason I'm doing this is to help you guys out if you're saving up for that house and you really really want to get it uh, or if you just want to buy a few nice cars but you don't have the credits to do so. So this is a really easy method of getting there. Now, the way in which you do this, first of all, is by purchasing a Willis Jeep for 40,000 credits. Now, in this one, I purchased five of them, so that added up to 200,000 credits. Uh, and then from there, I will show you what to do next, and it basically entails using skill points. Now, one thing to note, currently I'm sat on, I think at the beginning, it was 2.25 million credits, and I was level 70 as well. Now, after purchasing five of these Willis Jeeps, I spent 200,000 credits. Now, like I said, you do want to have some skill points available. If you're going to buy five Willis Jeeps, you need 25 skill points to use. So once you've done purchasing these five Willis Jeeps, or you can do more if you've got more credits to play with, it's entirely down to yourself, you're going to want to go into the Upgrades tab and then the Car Mastery to spend some of your skill points. Now first of all, you'll spend one point to earn 7,000 XP, and then go across to the right and spend one more point, and then directly above that for three points is a Super Wheel Spin. So once you've done this five times, you will have five super wheel spins to spend and of course you will have earned five times seven thousand xp per willis jeep which will basically level you up about three times which is what happened and from those three level ups you will of course get three wheel spins so even more to play with and even more chance to earn money now like i said this isn't some sort of glitch in the game or groundbreaking glitch or anything like that it's all legit and it's a nice way to earn a cushy amount of money now as you can see here i'm popping off and I'm just going into the My Horizon tab to spend the five super wheel spins. And from them, I got very lucky. And you pretty much make your 200,000 credits back fairly quickly. And like I said, in the process, you will earn some very, very cool cards. So already I've earned 150,000 credits and albeit some dance moves and, and bits of clothing, which we're not really bothered about. Um, but as you can see there, I have earned some very cool cards. And this is where the big money starts to come in. So 175,000 credits there, pretty much paid for all of the Jeeps itself, and again, and a nice rare car. So overall I spent 200,000 credits, and in that lot I made 615,000, and like I said, leveled up three times as well, and earned some very cool cars. And then I had three more wheel spins to spend, in which I got 40,000 credits, some shoes, which we'll overlook and another car as well now of course when you start earning these cards they add up into your accolades and you can earn more xp and credits and other cars from them as well now i will show you a few more later on where i've done more of the willis jeeps but first off you're going to want to earn more skill points after you've just spent them so what you want to do is pick out a formula drift car now with these you can get through the skill tree seven times multiplier and keep your drip, your skill chains going for 1.25 seconds longer than normal as well. And then you just want to hoon about for a while wherever it is. I was outside the Horizon Festival, so I did it pretty much on the drag strip. Uh, and as you can only earn a maximum of 10 skill points, you don't really want to spend a lot of time doing it. So you only really want to go up to about 60,000 skill points, then multiplied by 7 or less if you've got a skill song going. Now after this you're going to end up with a lot of Willis Jeeps and there are three ways to get rid of them. Now the first is just to remove them from your garage which I would not recommend doing. The second is to stick them in the auction house. Now although you won't get your full amount of money back you've probably earned way more anyway. You can stick it up for 4,000 credits and possibly someone might buy it out for 23k. Either way, you're still making some money back, or you can do what I've done, and once you've obviously unlocked some barn finds, you can then gift them out to new players or whoever if you want to do it that way, which is how I've done it, because at least then you're not sort of just letting them go to waste, or you can still end up selling them. Now, as I said, I've just shown you here five more times where I've done it, uh, and I'll let it play out, and you can see how much I've earned and how many cars I've got. Uh, as you can see there, the Aston Martin Valhalla concept, very, very cool, made it all worthwhile there and then. And after those first two wheel spins, again, I've made my 200,000 credits back. Everything else is just golden, new cars and credits, on top of the three extra standard wheel spins you get as well. So like I said, this is a really nice, easy method to make a quick buck, if you will, and a lot of quick bucks, shall we say. 
so it, it's really quite handy especially like I said if you're saving up for an expensive car or one of the expensive houses so it's definitely helpful in that sense and it shouldn't take away the whole aspect of grinding for things in this game unless you do milk it which I wouldn't recommend doing um, but anyway I hope this did help you out and I hope you make a little bit of credits out of it uh, and maybe win a couple of nice cars as well don't forget as well folks to hit that subscribe button as I will be bringing out more helpful guides uh, in the future and I'm going to be doing 50 laps on the Goliath race as well which should be painstaking but fun nevertheless just to see what the results will be from that. But like I said hope you enjoyed don't forget to drop a like and hit the subscribe button and all the best and take care.